Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this problem? 64 is to power x equals to square root of 16 then root 8. Here, let's rewrite this as 2 raised to power 6. That is, 2 multiply itself 6 times, that gives us 64, then raised to power x from here. So, same thing as, you know, 64 raised to power x, and this will give us, on this side, we have square root of 16, then we have root 8. Now, from here, we multiply this power so this is 2 raised to the power 6x from here which is equals to square root of 16 then root 8 then from here let's remove this square root on this side by squaring both sides so we square this side also we square this side then the square we cancel square root here then this 2 power multiplies and this will become 2 raised to the power 12x from here now then equals to 6 root 8 and uh, in the next step let's write root 8 in another way because root 8 means 4 times 2 so we can say this is 12 raised to power 2 raised to power 12x equals to 16 root 4 times 2 which we can separate as root 4 times root 2 so root 4 is 2 we take it out so we have 2 raised to power 12x equals to 16 times 2 then root 2 because root 4 is 2 then 16 times 2 to give us 32 so we can say this is 12 2 raised to power 12 x equals to 32 root 2 also from this side now we can square both sides again we square this side and also square this side so the square we affect these two number here and this power we multiply as well we have 2 raised to power 24x now equals to power of 2 we have affect 32 that's 32 square then times root 2 square square we can't square root and that's times 2 and from here we can write this in another way and this will be 2 raised to power 24x equals to 32 also can be expressed as 2 raised to power 5 then raised to power 2, we have 2 multiply itself 5 times, then that gives us 32, then times 2. So from here, we have 2 raised to power 24x equals to 2 raised to power 10, then times 2 raised to power 1, because power here is 1. Then applying the law of indices from here, we can add the power together, this will be 2 raised to power 24x equals to 2 raised to power 11. The base are equal here, we can equate the index. Then we have 24x is equals to 11. By the time we divide both sides by 24 from here, we have 24 cancel each other, then x will be equals to 11 over 24. So here we have the solution to the given problem here. x equals to 11 over 24. And we can check to confirm if this solution satisfies the given problem, please you can do that. Also, share this video and uh, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. See you next class. And bye for now.